They may look beautiful, but according to one international charity, they're killers. These women work in Colombia's fifth most successful industry, flower growing. But Christian Aid claims the pesticides they're exposed to are ruining their health. While the men who invariably do the spraying wear protective clothing, the women do not. One of the first symptoms of pesticide poisoning is headache. Complications include dangerous respiratory diseases. This grandmother has taken over her daughter's role of bringing up four children. Their mother, who was a flower worker, died last year. Even her death certificate states chemicals at work were to blame. Other women say their babies have been born with breathing difficulties because they inhaled chemicals during pregnancy. The local hospital in the small farming community of Madrid treats around 20 patients every day suffering chronic respiratory problems. But while doctors acknowledge the evidence of a link, Colombia's Flower Growers Association does not. The association doesn't have any um, knowledge of this kind of situation with the workers. We have heard, and this is just hearsay. Well, the government has banned the use of some chemicals and scrupulous employers who pay their workers more wages have ignored the guidelines. Christian Aid is urging foreign importers to support the campaign for better working conditions. Without their help, the 80,000 or so flower workers will continue to suffer.